What's up guys? Um, today I'm gonna be giving you a tutorial on how I like to cook. These Thai vegetable gyoza from Trader Joe's, they're really good. Um, might even be vegan, I don't know if it's made with the egg. Looks vegan. Yeah, pretty sure it's vegan. So Johnny, I think you can have these. Anyway, um, first thing I like to do with them is I put them in a pot like this to boil and then that'll cook them through nicely. So I do that for probably like five to six, seven, five, six minutes. Once you're, once once they cook through nicely, I like to crisp them up a little bit and I'll, I'll show you that next. And I put it at about like medium heat. I'm gonna use just a little bit of olive oil. Um, that's more than I need, I think, so I'll probably get rid of a little bit of that. If you don't have this like colander steamer thing, you can just um, put it uh, in water and it'll it'll still work. You can just put them at the bottom with the water. Um, this works a little bit better, but okay, get these last ones in there. What I'm doing now is I'm just making them a little bit crispier. Olive oil is gonna help with that. Probably do this for about five minutes also, um, and then you're. You're gonna wanna flip them like intermittently. Hear that crack? I'm gonna flip some of them. Just get that crisp on a little bit. Okay, while those are cooking, I'm gonna take you through my dipping sauce routine. Um, because you need some dipping sauce if you're gonna have some gyoza. Um, also from Trader Joe's, the sweet chili sauce. Put a little bit on the bottom here. Um, I'm gonna put a little, this is how much I use. I'm gonna put a little bit of sriracha in here. The spice. I don't have a bottle of soy sauce right now, but I do have all these packets from um, from takeout. I'm gonna use three of these, I think. Oh my God. Problem with these is, yeah, they're a little bit unpredictable. So it gets messy sometimes. Oh my. God. All right, whatever, that's fine. My mess from trying to open those packets. Gonna have to clean that. Walking back over here. Gonna give these guys another flip. I think these might actually be done. One of them got punctured, but that's okay, no big deal. Okay, I'm gonna take these off now. I'm not a fancy guy, like, I'm not much of a chef, so I'm just gonna put these in a bowl. that I think is really suitable for eating these is chopsticks. I think if you were to use a fork on these, it would just look totally barbaric. And if you don't have chopsticks, I'd recommend probably just using your hand. That'd be better than a fork. So going for the little dip here. Delicious, let see that vegetable cross section. Very good. I love it. Yeah, so these are one of my top items from Trader Joe's, so if you haven't given these a go, I'd definitely um, try them out. And um, that's a bit it for me. I'm going to enjoy my food. Bye.